We want to know, is the number 7,999,973 a prime number? The short answer is no, it's not. I mean, you can kind of stare at this and it's almost pretty obvious that this number is a multiple of 197. In fact, it turns out that it's 197 times 40,609. And so therefore, this number is not prime. Thanks so much for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, I'm kidding. That is not how I would solve this problem. Now, it is true to say that 197 times 40,609 gives you this number here. But of course, that's not how we're expected to solve it. And I definitely didn't spot that 197 is a factor of this number. How do we solve this without a calculator? Well, what we're going to do is make an observation that this number is just slightly smaller than 8 million. In fact, suspiciously slow. It's suspiciously so. And actually, before I continue down that, I guess one thing, and this is more of a problem solving tip, is if you're ever asked if a number is prime and it's in a competition setting or in a maths video, the answer is it's probably not going to be. And the reason I say that is because currently the only ways we can prove that a number is prime is just kind of testing all the numbers up to that number. So here, if I wanted to prove that this was prime, I would have to test all the kind of numbers smaller than 7,999,973 and show that they are not factors of this number, which isn't super exciting. Um, so it's very difficult to prove that a number is prime, but it's very easy to prove that a number is not prime just by showing that it factorizes. Cool. This number is slightly smaller than 8 million. How do we use that? Well, this number is in fact 8 million minus 27. And we might notice that 27 is a cube number. So this is three cubed. And very nicely, 8 million is also a cube number. In, in particular, it's 200 cubed. And so 8 million minus 27, we've got 200 cubed minus 3 cubed. We can use the difference of 2 cubed. So x cubed minus y cubed. Well, we can just use the factorization for this. This is x minus y times x squared plus xy times y squared. And this here is very easy to verify uh, just by expanding, but it is just the difference of 2 cubes formula. So this thing here should be the same as 200 minus 3 times 200 squared plus 200 times 3 plus three squared, like so. Now, this thing here is 197. This thing here is 40,609. It actually turns out that 40,609 and 197, they are both indeed prime, um, but that's not part of the problem. The part of the problem is determining whether this big number here is prime, and the answer is no, because it's the product of these two integers bigger than one.